there is, um, first of all, um, compelling, I would say overwhelming evidence that uh, the performance of this procedure, uh, bilateral cell pain gulfarectomy, um, will reduce the risk, lifetime risk of ovarian cancer somewhere of the order of about um, 80%. In addition, there is uh, more recent evidence that suggests um, that not only do you reduce the risk of ovarian cancer, but you reduce the risk of death, by all causes, by um, approximately 70 to 80 percent. And, and that, that finding is, um, is important because um, one would certainly say, well, isn't it great to reduce the risk of ovarian cancer? Um, and the answer, of course, that is yes. But, but what about the negative aspects of, of removal of uh, the ovaries in a premenopausal woman? Might there be an increased risk, for example, of death from heart disease um, because of the lack of estrogens now? Um, and might, the, because of the lack of estrogens, there be a much higher risk of um, osteoporosis and then pelvic fractures, and pelvic fractures leading to complications that might lead to uh, death. And so uh, looking at overall mortality, uh, death from all causes, is, is a, uh, also a very important question in addition to the question of the risk of ovarian cancer. And again, the, the data show that the risk of ovarian cancer is reduced, is reduced the risk of uh, premature death is reduced, very striking.